Welcome to our tech troubleshooting video. Today we're tackling a frustrating issue that many developers encounter when working with Docker and mail servers. Our viewer, Sashka, is struggling with accessing certain ports on their Docker mail server, specifically Dovecot and Postfix. Despite checking various settings, they can't figure out why ports 25, 587, and 993 are inaccessible from outside their server. Let's dive into the details and see how we can help Sashka resolve this mystery. Welcome back to another tech video. Today I'm going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully you find the solution. Now, don't forget to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and you'll hopefully get to the resolution. Now, let's continue on to the video. Let's start by understanding the issue. You have a Docker container running a mail server with Dovecot and Postfix, but you're unable to access certain ports from outside your network. First, check your Docker container's port mappings. You can do this by running the command docker compose ps. Ensure that the ports are correctly exposed and bound to the host. Next, verify your firewall settings. If you're using UFW, make sure that the necessary ports are allowed. You can check this with UFW status. If the ports are still inaccessible, it might be an issue with your hosting provider blocking these ports. You can use Nmap to scan the ports from both your local machine and the Docker host to see their status. Finally, if you confirm that the ports are blocked by your hosting provider, reach out to their support for assistance. They may need to unblock these ports for you. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. The issue with inaccessible Docker ports was resolved by the hosting provider. They identified a hardware firewall that was blocking certain ports. By enabling a specific mail server firewall rule set, the mail server could now function properly. And that's it guys. We've gone through, answered your questions, and hopefully found that solution that you're looking for. If we did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one.